Hey guys, just woke up. It's about 8 o'clock. Uh, I'm going to go get some coffee right now, and then I'm going to come back, and I'm going to make a song only using kitchen utensils. So, we'll see. I try not to do it a lot, but uh, there is something about getting up in the morning and taking a walk down to my favorite spot and getting a cup, you know? Try not to do it too much because it gets expensive, but it's just like a really nice way to start the day. Kind of get yourself moving and, you know, get some dank coffee. If you can kind of check it out, this walk is nice. I love this neighborhood around here. I love our spot, so. Yeah, so I got my coffee, and what I meant by uh, local place is it's a coffee bean. It's not a local spot, it's a chicken, but it's better than nothing, so. So I'm gonna head home, and I'm gonna start this uh, kitchen utensil song. Uh, pots, pans, everything that I can find in the kitchen, uh, but if it's a utensil, it counts, so. And I can transform the sound, I can do whatever I want to it, because I'm gonna have to make a bass out of something. I love walking down this little path on the way back home. I don't know, it's just like this little, it exists like right here. It's really short, like there's the road back there, but I don't know, it's nice. We're actually recording some guitar on my new track first. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so now I'm back. We recorded the guitar on one of my other tracks. Had to do that just real quick. We were kind of feeling it, but now I'm gonna start by uh, I'm gonna go in the kitchen, find some stuff. We got to get a kick, snare, shaker, bass, and then I'm gonna probably use some like glass percussion to make kind of like a lo-fi record or something like that. Like I don't know. We'll feel it out, but. Let's go find some stuff. All right, let's see what's up. All right, so I'm thinking like for a shaker, maybe we go with like a salt, like some salt right here, make, you know, like perfect. Actually, pepper seeds. A little bit of like tonal stuff. All right, well we need a kick. So I'm thinking like something like an orange is kind of and like this over here, it's like maybe like a little like. Okay. All right, so I got a few things around here that I found in the kitchen. We're gonna go ahead and make some percussion elements from it. And I think the hardest part is gonna be coming up with some melodic content just because like a lot of these things are atonal. Uh, which means like they don't really have much of a timbre to them, but the coffee mug, I think I'll be able to kind of do some glass stuff. I've seen guys like Swum or BDSU like doing lo-fi stuff, I've seen them do that. Uh, maybe we can even make something else with it, but yeah. So let's get started in recording everything and we'll just kind of go from there. All right, so let's get some like a little percussion guys going on in here. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and get this, this orange kick sound. Let's see if I can move some of this stuff. bruised orange. Alright, so I want to make a shaker. What better way than with some Quaker Oats? Alright, so now I have this pot and we're gonna see what we can get out of this. All right, so we need some kind of bass, and I know I did this before in another video, but bottles and basses kind of sound great, so we'll try and do that one. Nope. All right, so I found a different bottle, just like a metal one. This will probably work better. Yes. Okay, so now we have our full list of sounds, and I'm gonna go in and start making like a drum pack, making a bass, making some like lead sounds, and then we can see where we can go from there. 
as far as like what we can add for accents in the track or like kind of making loops so that uh, it can kind of become more of a full song. So I'm gonna go ahead and start doing that right now. <clears throat> so I took all the sounds and I kind of put them in an order that's cohesive. First I made some perk loops with some of those like coffee mug sounds we had. This kind of goes like... Kind of doubled that one, pitched it down. Frequency shifting on there, some grain delay to kind of make it knock all around. Bop, 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 bop. Okay. Some higher ones da, 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 going on there. Same thing, pitch down here. There's the I pitched up the uh, oatmeal and it made it a shaker. So, and then I got the bass here. Very loud, very like rumbly bass. That was also the bottle. So I pitched that down, put a little bit of saturation on it to make it really pop. But um, the last but not least, took the bottle, pitched it up and put it in a sampler. So now we have a melody. All right, so uh, what I want to do next is get a melody down for this uh, kind of flute sound that I made with the little bottle we got going on here. So that's pretty good. Um, so I also made another melody with uh, the pot lid that I had on there. I made a melody of that as well, so it's kind of like... So yeah, that's pretty much the beat. I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the video. You guys can hear the finished product, but uh, yeah, super fun making this. Uh, but yeah, you can do things like that with anything around your house. Like honestly, you can just find random stuff, get like a semi-decent mic and you can record it and and just kind of put some like reverb saturation like eq things out and have some processing on it and it just sounds incredible like i don't know i like this record all right now that that's done it's time to go on an adventure what's up boys you guys ready to go Merry Christmas. <laughs> okay. doing a little shopping with the guys maybe some costco costco Dude, smash that lock button. It's three o'clock. We gotta get going. We gotta stop playing around. We do on a scene. Okay. Food. Welcome to Costco, where we got tons of stuff, and a lot of it so much that you don't need more of it than us. I mean, I'd camp in the backyard. We can get one of those tents over there. Apocalasco. We are funny. People, let me tell you about my best friend. Yo, we got the hall. We got the mad hall. I'm going back home, start finishing some work. In Korea. Right now, you're still a blur. That's how blind I am. <laughs> right now, everything is gone. My whole everything. life is a lie, is and, and everything is black. You're just a black blur, TC. <laughs> I'm a blur. I mean, you got it pretty well. It was a Tyler Cornell, in his natural habitat, confused in the wild. Where should I put this card? Do I really exist? Who am I? Get out of my way. Look at him go, majestic. And he disappears out of sight. Yo, just got back from Costco. Uh, thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Let me know if you want more of these, kind of like making songs, using Foley. It's kind of nice to get away from synths and 
kind of explore your creativity in that way because I don't know, it just kind of gets it flowing. And, uh, yeah, it's really fun. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.